Wish I could see out of Selassie I. Maybe my sovereignty will still be mine If all the gangs in the world unify We stand a chance against the military tonight I said we stand a chance against the military tonight What's up world, it's your girl Brittany And today we have one fourth of Black Hippie Crew Abso Thank you for coming to see us Thanks for How are you? I'm great How Good I'm great, I'm so much better now that you're here if you were like a mad scientist, what would you do all day? Uh, I, I, I'd probably just like study the brain. You know what I'm saying? Try to really get one. Just, just research that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I, I do plan on doing that one day for sure. To be like a scientist? Like really just get access to a brain and do my own diagnosis. You know, the diagnosis from there. Feel like I'm affiliated with the Illuminati. Yeah. All seeing fucking eye. This is your enlightenment. I'm lighting this fire. My supplier always like to get higher than I've ever been. These heights are mighty fighting. So it's a, it's, it's a real deeply rooted thing. There's a lot of a lot of kids get caught up, you know, get get born into that. You know what I'm saying? Like literally born into it to where they have no choice. You know what I'm saying? And when you're under that circumstance, I, I can definitely understand and agree. But if you're uh, 21 years old and you say, hey, I want to join the gang, I just think that's retarded. Okay? If, you're, if you were born in the Nickerson Garden Projects, okay, and your father was uh, OG from Bounty Hunters, you would be a Bounty Hunter. Because you're his son, you know. Unless he would have it another way, don't want you to live that life. You got guys like that too. Because some fathers birth their children into, it. and he would have to follow in line as his father. And that's just that's parenting. So I'm not, you know, that's that's do what you do. But you know, like I said, if you're if you're a grown man, you know what I mean, and you want to join a game because you think it's cool. Or something like that. That's retarded. Back, remember when I had you smoking black in the back when top was gone? Now top is back. Is that me? We in Juice Garage. You know you my better ass. We superstars still mobbing the 7 Eleven. Fuck a car. There was a situation this past Sunday at Summer Jam, and some some words were, there's some words thrown at Nicki Minaj, kind of dissing her. And a lot of people were saying, hey, toughen up, like, have thick skin. If somebody said something, you know, bad about you, don't worry about it. Yeah. If you were in a situation and somebody said something about SOPA or thought it was whack, and you were supposed to perform, would you have performed? Absolutely. That's a great opportunity to go up there and do your stuff. It's just like, that was just like a great introduction, honestly. You know, if you want to ask me. But I mean, you know, Nicki Minaj is also a, a, a woman, you know what I'm saying? She. She has a very, very, very large audience, and you know, they, you know, I'm, I'm sure, you know, they, they want to be very uh, strategic on how they go about handling their business. You feel what I'm saying? So, I, I'm not gonna say they were wrong about doing that, and I'm not even gonna say that uh, Rosenberg was wrong for saying what he said because I mean, this is the culture. You know what I'm saying? This stuff, it was built out of speaking out. You know what I'm saying? Right. Speaking out of saying what you want to say, that's what that's what the culture was built out of. So I think that would have been a good opportunity for us to go out there and do our stuff. Just curse them out, right? Come, no, don't even curse them out. No, just do your thing? Go out there and do your set. Right. Come straight out to Starships. Yo, Absol, you can check me out on Global Grind. 